Apple Valley, a high school football player with a bright future killed by a hit and run driver. The intensifying search for the person behind the wheel. Plus, the FDA backs mixing and matching boosters. What this means for millions of Americans now eligible for an extra dose. And a notebook, a backpack, and human remains found during the manhunt for Brian Laundry. Could the search for one of the most wanted men in America be coming to an end? Now on the News at 10. And I'm Cher Calvin, a family grappling with grief and heartbreak, heartbreak tonight as a 14-year-old student athlete is killed while crossing the street. The driver took off without ever slowing down. Tonight, the parents of Lawrence Andrews are pleading for anyone who knows who was behind the wheel of the car to come forward. KTLA's Mary Beth McDade live in Apple Valley tonight, MB. Yes, and Mike and Jerry heard from so many here tonight at a memorial that was held for him about what an amazing kid that he was. And it really, it just breaks your heart that his life was cut so tragically short. He was going to turn just 15 years old next week.